Guess what? Look at there. It's snowing. <clears throat> Pretty light. You can see it coming down. I don't know if the camera will get it, but. Um, and it's the first time I've ever used this camera. I just bought it and I haven't even really read the manual. Just skimmed over it. I was going to make my first video about the camera and I wanted to read the manual then. But, uh, so I don't know what mode it is or anything. I tried to set it in a mode and I couldn't figure out the menu. Never had a camera like this before, so. It's, uh, it's a uh, 13 megapixel. They say it's 4K, but I think they use some software to try to bump it up. I've read about it before. I forgot what it's called. But, uh. Um, <clears throat> it is supposedly has does uh, 48 megapixel uh, in in photos, but well, I forgot it's a, it's less than that for a video, kind of like your phone. But uh, anyway, talking about the camera is no fun, is it? Let's see. We see the highway. Oh, you can zoom. See what the zoom looks like. Yeah, there's the highway. I don't know. Let's look at the trees now. It should start off. Hopefully, it started off in auto. No, how many? I don't know if it's in 4K or uh, the screen show in widescreen, so I don't guess it's in SD. Well, if it is SD, it's probably 720p, I think. So, um, it's, uh, let's go ahead and zoom back out now. Let's pause it. You're supposed to be able to pause it by hitting the uh, photo button. I'm going to pause it and then go to the front yard. There it is through our window. Snowing. <coughs> I don't think we had any snow last year. <coughs> this is in Azle, Texas, so we don't get snow every year. Okay. Now I don't know if I'm recording or not. <clears throat> well, this is a front yard if it's recording. Let me try pausing it again and I'll stop it and start a new video. Okay, I think I know that it's recording when it red light blinks. <clears throat> it better be not the opposite. So here's the front yard. My blazer sticking real good on the blazer in the van. Anything that's dirt, it's not sticking. In the street, it's not sticking. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> it's been, well, last I didn't check to see what it turned out. They said it was going to be 32 last night, which is freezing. 32 Fahrenheit here. And, uh, I mean... 32 is freezing in Fahrenheit, that's what I'm trying to say. But, uh, <clears throat> and today, uh, well, 32 and 33 for, I think tonight was 33, but of course it could be, you know, colder or a little warmer. And, uh, let's see what our tree looks like. I like snow and, I, and trees. Well, ice is pretty too, but ice, of course, is so heavy. Of course, we don't. Actually, one year we did have enough snow and then turned into ice that it did. Uh, that leaning tree in the backyard that I showed a while ago, it actually made it lean some more. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, well, we don't, you know, usually even think about... Uh, let me go in now because I'm cold. <clears throat> so, back at the back window, um, we don't usually even think about, uh, you know, ice damaging trees and stuff. 
but it's uh, here in, te in, in Azle, Texas, but uh, it, well, like I said, it did happen once out this tree, let me go up there, that leaning tree, it, uh, it was always leaning, we, we, we bought this house in like 64 or something like that, 1964, and uh, when I was a kid, and uh, Um, tree was always leaning, but not anywhere near that much. But over the years, it got bigger and heavier and made it lean more. In some years, we had lots of rain, and so, you know, it leans a little more because of that. And that one year, it uh, had enough snow that uh, it was zooming in on it. With the, with the blinds in the way, it didn't help. Well, there it is. I could see it better on the screen. Anyway, with the... Uh, that snow one year I was actually stayed on there for several days and it was heavy enough it actually did lean enough that you noticed it you know another foot or more probably. but it's so low back there now that that bottom branch uh, <clears throat> I haven't been back there lately but I think it's probably about I'm 5'11 I think it'll probably hit me in the nose or the top of the head now used to you know you could always get under it but walk under it but and there's some branches that uh, we trimmed off of it, a lower, well, a big, heavy lower branch. We cut it all the way off. So, oh, it's gone. In the last, well, I don't know. <laughs> Let's see. Can't re in the last, since 2000, the last 20 years, it's gone down like, it's leaned more 10 feet closer to the ground than it used to be, you know. So anyway, cool having snow. It's not a lot, and we would be surprised if we got any more than this. I mean. It's just, just barely, you know, drifting tiny little flakes, but enough, obviously, to uh, start covering the ground a little bit. But uh, <clears throat> anyway, that's cool. I'm going to check my video and make sure it works. I think I just paused it a minute ago. <coughs> yeah, that, the one that's the photo... <coughs> <coughs> the one that's the photo button pauses it. I remember that. The wind was blowing and got up over there on that side and it was blowing snow off of the just one little wheel. One one quick hard jump of wind. Well, I gotta figure out how to stop it. So uh try again.